Despite looking like Butterbean, Andy Ruiz still manages to send boxing heavyweights into oblivion. Well, it's very awkward. Nice boxing by Luis Ortiz, by the way, as he sees it. Oh, there he goes! Hey! He has ascended to the top of the most prestigious weight class, achieving all you can in the sport. And that's how he's a Ruiz counters, and Joshua is down! He's your new heavyweight champion of the world! And Andy Ruiz, man, you can't judge that guy on his belly. Now let's take a look at the illustrious career of Andy, the destroyer Ruiz. We push the pedal to the floor. In this game, we always ready for more. Ruiz made his premier boxing champion's debut in Carson, California's Dignity Health Sports Park in April 2019. Rico comes in with a record of 41 and four in his third fight. In the United States. Although Ruiz was five inches shorter than Dimitrenko, Ruiz used his lightning fast combinations and vaunted power to bring his towering opponent down to size. Guys gotta work out. Parker also defeated the measuring stick to try to good luck right hand by uh the truth. Oh to the action, so this is how it's gonna happen. Hopefully the one Ruiz came close to knocking out Dimitrenko in the fourth round, but the fighter was able to regroup himself. However, that was the start of the end for the exhausted German fighter. Andy Ruiz Jr. goes to 32 and 1. After Jarrell Miller's fight fell through with Anthony Joshua due to multiple failed tests of EPO and HGH. But what he has done, to be quite honest with you, is absolutely disgusting. Once again, the dude was popping his behind, popping his ass with performing enhancing drugs. Ruiz stepped up to the plate to take on one of the most dominant heavyweight champs of the era, AJ Anthony Joshua. Remember they didn't believe me. I cannot let them beat me. Ain't nobody teach me. We gotta do it ourselves. We gotta prove it in the down the fight for Anthony Joshua. Right hand! And down goes Pula! At the storied Madison Square Garden, where he was scheduled to defend the WBA, IBF, and WBO heavyweight crowns, Anthony Joshua entered the ring with a lot to lose against an unknown fighter like Andy Ruiz. The British fighter knocked down Ruiz with a brutal left hook in the third round, with Ruiz repaying the favor by knocking Joshua down twice in the second round. And getting right back in after he got this fight, and there he goes down! Big delivery from Anthony Joshua! Oh, with the right hand, the left hand six, close the deal. Seven! Ruiz seven, back on his feet after getting dropped by Joshua. Oh. Joshua, huge right! No idea how. Ruiz counters, and Joshua is down! Andy Ruiz knocks down Anthony Joshua for just the second time in his career. What a third round here at Madison Square Garden. Diving with a big right hand that lands on Joshua, and a flurry. Joshua covering up, headed towards the end of the round, and Joshua is down again! Body for Ruiz, and to a big left hand, and stung Ruiz, and then Ruiz right back to Joshua, and Joshua in trouble, losing his footing, he's down again. Anthony Joshua Four. is down for a Four. third time, landing a big blow, and now another, can Ruiz counter, Joshua's down again. Despite Joshua's efforts to fight back throughout the fight, Ruiz delivered two more knockdowns in the seventh round, and the referee decided to stop the fight when AJ once more failed to comply with his instructions. Maybe That's it. it! That is it! Andy Ruiz Jr. is your new heavyweight champion of the world! Shocking Anthony Joshua at Madison Square Garden! And now, the new unified IBO IBF WBA, WBO, heavyweight, champion of the world, Andy Destroyer. Yes.
rapidly growing army of fans behind him. The Destroyer took on Luis King Kong Ortiz. A win over Luis Ortiz would put him in a position to challenge for the WBC belt held by Tyson Fury. The 32-year-old was competing for the first time in 16 months since defeating Chris Ariola by unanimous decision. Well, that's a hell of a fight. A hell of a fight. Ortiz, on the other hand, came off an electrifying knockout over Charles Martin. Andy Ruiz consistently beat Ortiz to the punch time and time again, dropping him three times in the first and seventh rounds before finishing the fight to raise his record to 35 and 2. Nice boxing by Luis Ortiz, by the way, as he sees him. Oh! That's how fast Andrew Ruiz is, and now Ortiz is on very hard. His hand back, so... Whoa. There's a right hand, Ortiz is backed up. With his jab, that's what he's got to do to measure him. Wax him with the right hand again. He's oh. getting dangerous, is, and down goes Ortiz. Fight that has lacked, sustained by a... Big right hand by Ruiz. Oh. That rocked Ortiz. Good. Both fighters with a lot of heart. Yeah, good fight. A lot of skill. The Destroyer, Andy Ruiz. Was it to force the action, given that he was the first southpaw you faced as a professional? It was pretty difficult, man, but the ability that I have of me counterpunching and waiting for him to load up and me counter him and connecting him to, and dropping him, it was a blessing, man. I just want to thank God so much. This is for culture. A vulture is my eye. You are my target. In the main event of Saturday's Premier Boxing Champions pay-per-view, Andy Ruiz had just come off a 17-month layoff since relinquishing the Unified Heavyweight Championship in a lackluster decision. Fighting pride of London, England. And the nightmare was looking to get back into the win column after losing a unanimous decision to Adam Konoski. Tomorrow's coming is just another day in the office, and uh, I put in the hard work, I put in the, the days in the gym, and on, on Saturday, it's time to showcase. It's time for both of us to go to war. It's time for us to uh, leave all friendship aside because at the end of the day, you know, I consider him a friend. I consider him a boxing friend. But again, once you step in the ring, friendship's out the door. Ruiz was knocked down in round two by a quick right hand from the 40-year-old Areola. And knock him out, but uh, Anthony Joshua was just trying to get that win. Wow, hard, fast right hand from Ruiz. Let's see how quick he is. Ruiz has it. Look at him doing most offense. No. This a chance to win this fight. I don't think the judges could have the same. I think this is. Oh! Eight. And Chris Howard. Oh, one combination, then another combination. That's a then good, another combination. That's a good three punch combination. Ruiz would get his legs back under him in the third round by using sharp combinations and movement to offset the rhythm of Areola. Even Deontay Wilder was there. He turned it around, but he turned oh. it toward the end of round two. Oh! Big hook. Andy Ruiz sailed to a unanimous decision. Andy, the destroyer!